So you have a modified connect rig, but you just don't know how to line it up with your own. Not a problem. In object mode, click the rig, control C to copy, file, open, find your project, and in object mode, control V to paste. All right, you can go ahead and hide all these objects. All we really need is the skeleton. Now, once you're here, you have to align the connect rig with your own. Start in with the pelvis. Go to the front view and press S to scale it up or down until the base of the spines are the same. Make sure that you do this in object mode with scale. Do not go into edit mode and move the spine in place manually. If you do, you will mess up the data for how far the body is away from the floor. Once you've aligned the spine, then you can go into edit mode and start moving the bones where they're supposed to be. The easiest way to do this is to go up here, set this to individual origins, turn snap on, and make sure that it's set to vertex. From here, if you click on a bone and press G to move it, it will automatically try and snap to the location of the bones in the other rig. From here, it's pretty easy. There aren't two many bones. Just remember that if you have an FK rig, align the hands and feet with their original hand and feet bones. But if you have an IK rig, align the hands and feet with their corresponding IK control bones instead. Also for now, go to pose mode and click the hands, set target armature to your character rig, and set the bone to forearm. This is just a quick way to get your hands to behave normally while we get the rest of the rig hooked up. Alright, once you've got everything lined up, the only thing left to do now is connect them together, which I will show you in the next video. As always, if you enjoyed this video, Video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell. Hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.